Did you ask Mike, and I know this is something that people have debated, did you ask Mike or did you talk to Aubrey about Cameron and Harper and what actually happens between them? It's interesting. People are fascinated by that. I, um, I uh, No, because you don't go. I, I guess it's kind of a slightly awkward conversation to be like, what exactly happened? Was it <laughs> Why you is know, that third awkward? base, I, yes, exactly. fifth base? Um, <laughs> yes, yes, Theo, it was fifth base. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> what was used? Um, I... I I always read it that it, that they didn't, um, and that was kind of what Mike suggested, really, mm -hmm. um, that they didn't go the full hog. But in a way, it doesn't matter because she, they step over the line. Right. So whether they, you know, went to seventh base, base and did kind of deep dark stuff, or they had a smooch, it's kind of much of the same, right? right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in yeah. a way. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, because I guess like, and especially in what a theme of these of these couples, like, what is betrayal and how do you exactly. define betrayal? Yeah. And where is that? Um, is that a kind of rubber? Is that a flexible term to some people within relationships? Exactly. And that's, you know, with Cameron and Daphne, that was is his dissection. It's about how we understand how the mechanics of a relationship work. And should we judge a couple? Um, based on how they function, if it if it functions for them, then is that okay? I, I don't know the answer to the question, to be honest. But that that's the you know the existential question: um, should you judge them, or however it works? Are we restrained by the cultural ideas of relationships that predispose us to certain ways of thinking from our parents and from their parents?